Nissan. And here we're going to explore mobility services for passengers and deliveries in Japan and France. And we'll share with everyone more about that work as we make more progress going forward. But what about Waymo's own service? We got that started in April 2017 when we first invited folks to join our early rider program. And after a year and a half of learning from them, we took the next big step in December 2018 by introducing our public ride hailing system, which we call Waymo One, which now has over a thousand riders who hail Waymos via our mobile app. Now we've been testing at small scale in fully driverless mode since 2017 with no trained human drivers behind the wheel. And we've begun to responsibly ramp our driverless offerings to our riders in the Metro Phoenix areas. I'll tell you, one of the things we love the most at Waymo is watching the reactions of first time riders as they experience this fully driverless world for the first time. I thought you might like to see what that looks like. We've got a short video to share here. Thank you. We're here. We made it. That is 